So Sarah, 3,593 square metres of land north facing riverfront. Yeah, so this is truly unique and uh, it's not many times I've been invited to a property of this size. And obviously your investment firstly is in the land size and the potential and this amazing view. I mean, you're just so elevated and you can capture it from everywhere in the house. But I mean, to get this much land on the river, I mean, normally you've got a smaller block which gives you a smaller corridor, so therefore you're just sort of a completely directional orientation. Mm. Whereas here, it's really 180 degree panorama, isn't it? One of my favourite things is seeing people walk through the front door for the first time and go, wow, look at this view. And it doesn't disappoint. And I don't think you'll ever get tired of this amazing aspect as well, north facing, it's just so hard to find. But it's true, isn't it? You walk in this house and the thing is you actually open the front door and you just look straight at the view. I mean, forgetting how big this house is, this is more of a compound than just a house because there's actually several houses on the block. Yeah, so that's the great thing about the property and, and we do call it an, an estate because we've got this amazing residence which was built in 2010, full solid concrete, five bedroom oversized home and then you have a guest residence which is attached and also an office and gym. It's just it's got everything. So when they built this home, it was up for many awards and the coffered ceiling won an award for seamless design and it's so elegant, it's just timeless. Well, I mean, we've got travertine floors throughout. The ceilings are overscaled, oversized. The proportions of this house all are actually quite fitting, aren't they? Mm. But it's not overwhelming because it's just large scale rooms looking at that magnificent view. So. Although it is under roof a large home, the rooms work and the separation, lovely amount of bedrooms, but places where people can study or watch TV, there's so many options. So it is a house that you can grow up into because you do have those different spaces. You've got the guest houses, you've got the, the pool house. I mean, the pool house is, is quite spectacular. Down there is over a million dollars spent on the riverbank and that's with an enormous jetty, pontoon, and also a guest residence for entertaining. It's, it's superb, you can have a massive boat out the front. So you can actually just almost live down that little jetty, it's that good. It's that good. You could actually have a date night down there and the kids could be up at the house because you'd be completely separate with those mesmerizing views. So one of the things I feel is important with a house, especially a house of this sort of grandeur, is that sense of arrival when you get to the property. You come in the gate, you cascade down the stairs, you're greeted by the pool, then you come to these beautiful doors and chandelier. And I think what I really enjoy is that when you open those doors, the whole house isn't given away. Well, from the street, there's a most amazing fence line and hedge line. The gardens won't disappoint, they just enhance the property. They've spent a timeless amount of energy to make these manicured gardens effortless. Well, it's meticulously maintained. Yeah. There's nothing in this house that looks tired. This house, to me, looks like it has been in the same condition from the day it's built. Yeah, they've absolutely looked after it, so it will feel like a brand new home.